Welcome back to Ancestors and Alcohol. So today I have another black owned alcohol wine review and it comes from Flow Wine. Um, a little bit about Flow Wine. It is owned by Marcus Johnson. He's a jazz pianist. So he plays the piano and he also makes wine. That's the both worlds. Um, so I have the Moscato here. It is a 2014 California Moscato. It has 11% alcohol and this is a 750 milliliter bottle. Um, I was actually gifted this wine. My brother got it for me for my birthday and he actually got me the two other, two other wines. So it's Moscato, Chardonnay, and a red blend. So I'll be trying out the other two um, in the upcoming weeks. But today I was excited to try the Moscato because I do like Moscato and it's starting to get warm outside and I just love a nice Moscato on a warm day. So, um, and I was happy that this had a screw top instead of a cork screw. For some reason, I just like screw tops or whatever. I don't know why. But um, I believe this bottle of wine, I looked online and it goes for $12 if you're a member of the Revel Wine Club and then it's $15 if you're a non-member. I'm not sure how much my brother paid. I can ask him and find out if anybody is interested. Um, so, let's go ahead and taste this wine. It smells good. It smells sweet and soft. I like that. I don't know why it took me so long to taste it, like, you know, get it in there. Um, it tastes fruity. I feel like I taste a pear, like pears in there. And this was weird because this wine didn't come, like it doesn't have anything in the back to say, or like on the back or the front to say it has hints and notes of this. So you just kind of got to make up your own, you know, you just got to come to your own conclusion on what it tastes like. But it is good. And it goes down really smoothly. I'm really tasting this pear. And of course I taste grapes and everything like that. But I think this has some pear in it. I don't know. Maybe I need to go look online to see what it has in it. But anyway, this is really good. Um, I would drink this. Well, actually... After I make this video, I'm going to go sit down, pop me some popcorn, and watch my TV shows that I missed this week. So that's what I would do with this Moscato. Or I would go sit out on my back porch, you know, get some nice music playing, maybe some Marcus Johnson. I like jazz a lot. And just hang out and chill out or whatever. So you can check out... Um, Marcus Johnson and his wines online and I'll put the link below so that you can go to his website you can purchase the wine on the website and also it has a store locator my brother got this wine in Charlotte but I think it was like all in Charlotte um, North Carolina I think maybe Atlanta but the store locator on there will let you know where you can get the where the closest store is where you can buy the Marcus Johnson um, flow wine well, beautiful black people, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Please subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Follow me on Facebook or Instagram at Ancestors and Alcohol. Um, and also check out my blog. I'll put that link below. And if you have any questions, you know, just ask. If you have any, you know, suggestions on any black-owned alcohols that I could do, please send them to me. Um, I would be more than willing to try any black on alcohol. So goodbye, beautiful black people.